week's vlog is going to be a little bit different. Ashley and I are here at the Dallas Market Center as buyers for Catapult Creative House. And so I'm going to be vlogging and showing you guys what we'll be doing here. So we've been walking around and we actually found one of our vendors, Easy Tiger, that we already sell at Catapult. So that's kind of interesting. So we just found our first Made in Missouri vendor, Trap Fragrances, so we're probably going to look around and see if it's something to shop for. Hey guys, we're really excited. We just found this makeup line and it's all Made in Missouri, so hopefully you'll see it in Catapults. An eventful day here at the Dallas Total Home and Gifts Market. We've talked to lots of vendors, we visited the gourmet market, saw some apparel showrooms, and now we're exhausted and hungry, but we're ready to come back tomorrow, right out in Bushy Tail, and see what else there is. Got to the market center for day two. We're on our way to meet a sales rep for a meeting, oh, yeah. and then we're gonna start exploring. And today we have our first event, which is the fall or the fashion trends and colors report for 2016. So we're really. Hey guys! Yesterday was such a busy day we forgot to film a video of what we all did. Um, we started off the day with a flat tire, but made it to the market all right, and we went on a tour with Jay Schwenke and got to know about all the different color and trend reports that are popular for 2016. Um, we talked to more vendors, we placed an order for a makeup line that we're going to bring to Catapult, so we're really excited for you guys to see that. It was a really exciting day filled with a lot of new things, a lot of walking, our feet were exhausted, and a lot of free samples. So we hope you guys are enjoying this. We're enjoying ourselves here, and we can't wait to tell you what we're doing these next two days. We spent a lot of time dedicating it to the temp floors, and temp floors are where vendors who don't have permanent showrooms can set up little temporary areas. So we went through that, found a lot of cool stuff. Um, mostly we spent yesterday wandering around since the first day we went through so many different floors and so many different vendors. And then we took a little time, went to the kids' area. Um, there was a mashed potato bar that we got to go to, and then probably the coolest thing we did was we went to a meet and greet for Where Women Create. Um, we got to meet Jo Packham. She's the creator of Where Women Create Business Magazine, and we got to talk to her, get a lot of advice from her. She was a really awesome person to talk to, so that was something that we were really excited about. So we're back at the Dallas Market for day three, and we just placed our second order for the day. We have these Lindsay Phillip flip flops. These are really cute because you can snap off, don't throw off from this part and put a new one on so that if you want to change it up each day or based on your outfit, you can do it. And then we also ordered these cute ones where the jewel snaps off. And you can put a new one based on how you're feeling. So we're really excited for these and we hope you guys are too. So this is our last day at market and it's been really exciting. Yesterday we got to go on a tour, looking at all the different window and visual merchandising displays and Jay Schwanke got to tell us how to create a good display and kind of the colors and elements you need to bring into it. We've purchased more stuff, we've got our first ever kids stuff so we're excited to get that at Catapult and today is kind of just more of a chill day, walking around seeing whatever is left to do. So our time at Dallas Market is officially over and we've had an awesome time. We've got so many samples, we've bought new things for Catapult, we've seen Paula Dean, gone on tours with Jay Schwanke, and met the creator of Women Great Business Magazine. We've had an awesome time and in August we're going to be doing a presentation of everything we did here so that other fashion students can learn the specifics of our trip so that they too in the future can move.